spoon fed. Yeah, I start to feel like I'm the best. I'm getting all these streams. And I'm making money off my raps. This a fucking dream. What that bitch is ugly, though. She dressing up for Halloween. Niggas know it's big for L. Come and join the team. So it has been quite some time since we last talked about the Neons and the Jack Doherty. Yo, did Neon die? Is he alive? He said he had like three days to live. I ain't heard from this nigga since his ugly ass, bro. If he died, shit, like. I can't really. Yo, this nigga's so ugly, too. Look at this nigga. This world. And that's mainly because ever since the crossover episode we did a couple of months did back, they fight? Dumb and Dumber have been losing relevance. These niggas fought? <laughs> wait, wait, wait. All right, all right, hold on. Sorry. Y'all know we gotta go ahead. I ain't even. I'm not tapped in with the dork ass. I type in YouTuber and Mr. Beast comes up. What type of glaze is that? What, what, what do you get out of that, bro? What I didn't fucking do shit. What do you get out of that, bro? Get out of my face. That's a new interceptor. Oh, 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 oh! That was weak. <laughs> that was fucking weak. <laughs> that was weak. Run that shit. That shit was not worth it. Y'all remember when Neon got jumped? Yeah, he need to do that shit again. This he need to learn a second time. I think he like a, a active learner, like a hands on learner. Maybe he'll get some hands from it. Dumb and Dumber have been losing relevance Damn. at an alarming rate ever since. For Neon, it was recently exposed that over 98% of his audience is bots. This nigga only- I mean, shit, that makes sense, bro. Let's keep it above. I'm not gonna lie. You gotta be a different level of autistic to sit here and watch Neon streams. Like, this is already just, like, this is too high of a number. 98%. 99% of this nigga- View bots, bro. I mean, I don't know who this is, so I'm not even about to see her in X shot, but like Neon, is it not? I don't even think he should have this many. Like, bro, give these to me. What the fuck is he doing besides getting jumped and, and being cut out? Like, bro, y'all gotta sub, y'all gotta follow a real. <laughs> You're a fucking asshole, bro. What was that? Why would you do that? And for Jack, I think most people were just fed up with his obnoxious behavior. Meaning their clips are not really- Look at this face! I just want to sock this nigga, bro. Let me- Yo, let's hurry up and turn up and get some clout so that way I can like just clout chicks. I'm not gonna lie, bro. I want to fight this nigga. I will box this nigga. One arm behind my back, I will box this nigga. I- Like, bro. I got that much confidence, I will win. Don't nobody say, oh my god, Neon went wild. Nobody say that shit. Nobody said, oh shit, chill, bro. I'm about to watch Neon stream real fast. Nobody says that. I promise you nobody said Nobody. Nobody says, yo, I'm about to tap in this Jack Doherty YouTube vid. No, they don't. Around their streams has died down as most of the antics seem fake, played out, or for attention. Did y'all see that? This died down as most of the antics seem fake. This nigga eyes shot to the camera, bro. We saw the block, bro. And you have to understand that the shelf life for these type of creators is often very short. Because for one, the people digesting the content are so young, and they move on to the next shiny toy, or in this case, shiny streamer, very fast. And the other thing is that shock value content can oh, only last what? for so long. Ew! I would how would you just think? I would have socked that bit. I swear to look at her mouth. Nah. We need bro, they need a real nigga in that type of community, bro. I'm not gonna be the one. I'm not sacrificing myself for that shit. But bro, I would bro, I promise you. It, you would have been nobody would think you was wrong if you hit her. And you know overall IRL streaming as a genre has been experiencing some serious that growing pains die. lately, especially in regards to the platform kick which has obviously created an environment where idiots get on every day trying to go viral by being a degenerate. Like recently shot? when I saw this video of this guy who approached a cop trying to get a reaction out of him by telling him that he needs to go and reboot his friend who apparently died in the line of fire. Damn. While holding up...
That's not. Come on, bro. That's fucked up. Why are niggas doing Printed that? Printed out picture of the fallen cop. Do you know who this is? I don't. It's a dead cop from Oakland Police Department. What Go dig him up. Why would I dig him? Ha ha. He's never coming back. We didn't bring the reboot card. You have to go get it before it expires. What's the reboot card? It brings them back to life. You ever play Fortnite? You got. How you going, bro? Th these are the corniest nigg. These are the nerd neck ass niggas. I swear, bro. What? Ha ha. Go dig him up. You going to tell a nigga dig him up? You better be the most gangster nigga ever. Cause what if he just? What if he ain't give a fuck that damn just shot you? What? Bro, and then you gonna say you ever heard of Fortnite? You can't say, bro. The same nigga can't say you ever heard of Fortnite and go dig your homie up. You can't, you can't, it don't work, bro. You gotta be, that's two separate niggas like dialogue right there. Why the f <sighs> So yes, the users of Kick are definitely killing the platform itself. But I guess what can you really expect when they've openly supported that bullshit since their inception? And with this newest Jack Doherty clip, things got so bad that they have literally decided to ban him forever. All right. Alright guys, so in this clip you're gonna see Jack Doherty is speeding around in his McLaren Bro, he that he bought by selling his body on Is he slow? Online and doing weird things like kissing That's not real. Yo, this isn't What? What? Are you the island boys and as you guys can see jack is driving around in the rain he's going a cool 71 miles per hour and he is simultaneously streaming driving and obviously in this frame looking down at his phone and that's where jack really makes his mistake instead of just letting this car merge in in front of him and kind of slowing down which would be the responsible thing to do given the weather he decides to try and punch it oh oh no no! And anyone who <laughs> Yo, it's not funny. It's not funny because he could have died, but it's like, no! No! Nigga, shut up. <laughs> shut the fuck up. <laughs> Yo, what the so he crashes the car, the stream kind of goes out for a second there. Obviously, I'm guessing the airbags deploy, which create this smoky scene. No, watch out, watch oh. out. Oh. Oh. Open the door, open the door, open your door. Really Jack obviously continues to panic. Locked in here. Holy shit. Oh shit. Oh, oh. And I mean, when you're in a situation like this where you're stuck in the car, obviously. Hydro point and driver's head. Yeah, bro. That shit, nothing, that ain't no joke. And I mean, when you're in a situation like this where you're stuck in the car, obviously things can get pretty scary. I mean, you never know if some shit's going to explode, catch fire. And so I guess I'm trying to say this is obviously like a life or death type of situation. So apparently. Look, shoot the window! I can bust that. Wow, what? Fuck all this. This guy was gonna pull out maybe some sort of pistol and shoot out the window, which obviously if there is people standing around, which uh, in no, a second facts. you're gonna okay, see this. Okay, okay, facts, facts, facts. Okay, I forgot about that. I forgot about that. So here the stream kind of goes dark and this is the next thing that you see. Holy shit. Holy fucking shit. Oh, Michael. Are you okay? Yeah. Holy this nigga was bleeding? Oh put my. the fucking cam down, nigga! Bro, put the cam down! Oh my god, bro! So as you guys could see there, the car is all f***ed up. I am gonna have to blur the dude's face, but that apparently was his cameraman there. Damn. He's obviously all f***ed up, okay? He's bleeding profusely out of his face. And what do you guys think the first thing Jack Doherty cares about in this situation? Is it the health of his friends and his employee? Do we even or is it the cloud? Bro, my whole f***ing car, bro! 
damn. You don't ask because your homie cool. You just, my car, oh my car, my car. If you gave a fuck about the car, bro, you would not have been on. Your, you mean, you looking at chat. Chat, chat. Should I punch it, chat? Should I really just, should I just give it some gas, chat? And you bang out. What the fuck do you expect? Bro, niggas be think. I don't know. I don't know what be. I don't know. Nigga almost checking you worry about the cam, bro. Nigga worry about the stream. You almost died. I'm like, fuck stream. I would have threw that camera out. Oh my gosh. I mean, to me, the thing when an accident like this happens is like, bro, you can always get another car. I'm sure he has great insurance on a expensive vehicle like this. Like, be worried about your friend. Be worried about your employee, bro. F the car. There's no f***ing... Michael, here. Michael. Yeah, on that phone too. What? This dude is like he told this nigga, bro. He told this nigga to. This nigga's bleeding out his fucking head, and you over, yo, bro, yo, bro. Hold this cam, bro. I need this clip. Hold this cam, bro. This Lambo is ugly as shit, though. I don't got the bread to really be like making judgments, but at the same time, I'm gonna get there one day, and I'll be able to say, yo, that shit was terrible. Jack Doherty Lambo, poop, bro. Bleeding out his fucking dome piece, and the guy's like, Michael, you gotta get this. Record me, bro. I know you're losing piece. massive amounts of blood by the second, but I need this clip. I haven't gone viral in months. And then when you start to piece together some of the other clips, it makes him look even worse. This is actually something that Jack decides to post this onto his Twitter saw, page himself. Help! 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 These are the people. You worry about the rock! This nigga screaming help! Bro, this nigga about to die screaming help. He over here holding the camp. Yo, I gotta get this angle though, bro. You gotta peep. I gotta get the angle. I don't care if I'm about to die. I'm gonna scream help and get the angle. Well, I was talking about. Oh! Oh! <laughs> oh! Oh! What the fuck, bro? Oh, fuck. Can you hold this? Jack looks like a scared little girl. He does. And they actually pull <laughs> the man child right out of the car like a baby. I hope us watching this don't put no money to his name. Bro, I hope he don't get a cent from this video. I hope I just get... When I post this on YouTube, I hope this shit just monetize, bro. And this is like... You feel me? <laughs> Did this nigga just get picked up? Yo, like a boy ass girl. <laughs> the man child right out of the car like a baby <laughs> <laughs> nigga said can you hold this dude that's why you gotta love mexican people man when are we not gonna stop to help Fuck, you out dude. man my f car holy shit no so yeah his boy is just all f***ed up in the passenger seat and he's like my car i need the clips i mean thankfully in the end his friend michael would be all right but jack is just such a tool for this entire his eyes are just dead in the camera this nigga just can you grab this phone please as you guys saw he was looking down at the phone he was also streaming which i believe you're not supposed to do if you're actually driving like trying to entertain your audience and looking at your chat and then also given the conditions and the fact that he's probably not really that equipped to drive this sports car instead of just letting that truck merge he decides to punch it and in that moment completely f***ed up his entire life and of course jack had to capitalize on the clock he's still going yo this nigga don't stop this, if this nigga was in any other profession I'm gonna keep it a buck. The nigga would probably be successful. Like he, he, he be, nah, he'd be a corny ass nigga. Like he's a corny successful nigga. Like, but this nigga got some dedication. I, I could give him that. He, he a lame ass nigga for sure, but he, he got some dedication. Out as he posted this video from the hospital. All right guys, we're in the hospital after the crash. How you feeling Michael? Amazing. Just getting stitches right now, but. Can you guys imagine being I'd be so pissed. I ain't gonna lie. I probably sock my man's. I probably would have got by. Hold on. I, I need to break and just steal this nigga because you're not about to sit here. You don't give a fuck. The nurse who has to deal with these douchebag influencers. Either way, after this incident, Jack was apparently permanently banned from Kick for pretty much.
had to clap it up again fuck this nigga. much endangering his friend and kind of engaging in this reckless activity i mean you guys know that kick is pretty much the most degenerate platform out there and so to get banned by them you have to really you gotta do some They've dumb given... shit some dumb ass shit jack chances time and time again and he essentially continues to spin the face of his opportunities and above that all, the little douchebag would actually use this entire situation to try and like garner sympathy while also pushing his quote unquote spicy content. I mean, I will. What? This nigga do. Is he gay? Is that why they showed the Island Boys kissing this nigga? In the I'm cool off this vid, bro. Let's move on.